welcome back students to one more session now as i said as i promised earlier i'll be doing a series of tricks in your inorganic chemistry physical chemistry yes as well as organic chemistry now i'll be starting with this important concept that is how to find log without log tables in the exam basically whenever you're doing the physical chemistry numericals you need to have that log table isn't it nernst equation numericals will be there chemical kinetics or you need to solve the rate equation or you need to find the order of the reaction right so for all these you may require log but now here i'll be giving you a concept without opening the log table right log table book you can find directly write the answer in the exam how to do first of all for that remember some basic things what are they i'll be asking you to remember one two three four five five values you remember and go all the sums will be easy what are the first important thing basic you remember log 2 how much is log 2 3010 okay next remember you need to remember log 3 value that is 0 0.4771 after that remember log 5 value which is 0 0.699 and you have to remember log 7 value also because i'll be using only these five values everywhere log 7 value is 0 0.8451 last but not the least log 11 is 1.0414 yes and one more basic thing which you should remember let us draw a line because remember by heart all this or remember memorize i'll send you all these values and go it's easy right now next we very well know what is log 10 it is 1 what is log 100 it is 2 what is log 1000 it is nothing but 3 isn't it right with this basic thing now let me start how to solve in the exam right so i'll give you first one certain uh, important things then we we'll go to the example suppose i have to deduce how can i deduce just see here suppose i have log 4 with me how can i write see i know only these five values i'll be applying in all the examples i have to find log 4 how can i find log 4 i don't have in this isn't it i only know 2 i only know 3 i only know 5 i only know 7 i only know 11 i need to find log 4 is given simple how can log 4 be written as it can be written as log 2 plus log 2 yes what is log 2 i have in my mind isn't it 30.3010 one more okay into 2 also i can write log 2 again this one into 2 nothing but certainly how much do i get i get 0 0.6020 over isn't it log 4 value i know 2 2s are 4 so i've written that value okay one more example let's take one more and see suppose uh, log 6 is there with me how can i write log 6 but i don't know log 6 value isn't it how can i write log 6 if i have to see it is nothing but 2 into 3 isn't it 2 3 is 6 so i can write log 6 as log 2 <coughs> plus log 3 I have in my mind two value see here I have in my mind three value so apply that log 2 is how much it is nothing but 0 1 0 plus log 3 is 0 0.4771 if I add these two I get an answer of 7781 finish isn't it now I got log 6 value nothing to memorize suppose if I have log 8 because here I have memorized 2 I memorized 3 I memorized 5 I, mem I memorized 7 I don't have 6 I don't have 4 isn't it so now they've given me 8 also I don't have log 8 according to the table how can I write this log 8 is nothing but 2 cube isn't it yes 2 into 2 into 2 how can I write this this can be written as 3 log 2 isn't it yes so i know two value already 3 into 0 0.3010 which comes to 0 0.9030 okay see here now what what values i know yes so log 9 also we will do i can uh, now i need to find log 9 fine so log 9 if i have to write 3 3 is a 9 isn't it log 3 table now log 3 plus log 3 okay get into the things which you have learned log 3 value is how much already we have written log 3 as 0 0.4771 into oh, sorry plus 0 0.4771 <coughs> which comes to 0 0.9542 now observe carefully what what did we learn i i memorized two i memorized three i got four i memorized five i got six i memorized seven i got eight i memorized i got nine i also have log 10 i have 11 
okay that's over isn't it yes so i have got the basic thing now let us solve this in with certain examples suppose in the exam they have given me log 23 what to you know, solve this how should you do i know i'm not using the log table now what do you do you approximate this to 24 now write down 24 can be written as how log 6 plus log 4 why did i write this because 6 4 is a 24 now log 6 can be again written as what what do we learn we said log 6 can be written as log 2 plus log 3 okay then log 4 as usual nothing uh, in this so log 4 can be written how can it be written it, it can be written as log 2 plus log 2 okay now what is log 2 if i write the whole thing right i've already solved this earlier isn't it so if i have to write this is 0 0.7781 plus 0 0.6020 when I add these two, I get 1.3801 answer, right? So, just what do you do? Once you get this, take a bit lesser, lesser value. Now, 1.38, if I have to do it exactly with the log table, I'll approximate how much will I get? I'll be getting an answer of 1.36. Uh, this, this answer I'll be getting. So, little less value we can take. 1.38 instead of 1. Point, because they'll see this decimal, not a problem. Above uh, 5, this is above 5. So, the answer is this. So, this is the answer which I've got how did i get i have learnt only two law log two i have learned log three and with these two values i found it easy isn't it let us do one more example suppose if they give me one more example that is log 85 now i said what do you do you approximate this to log 84 simple now log 84 if i have to write in the form of table it can be written as log 7 plus log 12 isn't it 12 7 is 84 right now, log 7, uh, did we learn uh, this log 7 table already? I told, I taught you to remember log 7 value. That is nothing but 0 0.8451. Now, 12. How can 12 be written? 12 can be written as, it can be written as log 3 plus log 4, isn't it? It can be written as log 3 plus, log 3 value also I know. Log 4 value also I know. How much is log 3 value? It is nothing but 0 0.4771. What is log 4 value? Which I have read. Log 4 can be written as log 2 plus log 2. Isn't it? So, that is 3010 into 2. So, finally, if I add all this multiply, I get an answer of 1.924. Yes. So, now slightly take, uh, uh, take slightly like, uh, more uh, value because approximate when you see you know it is it will almost be a, a bit higher than that you can take 9.93 or or to 1.94 slightly higher 1.93 to 1.95 approximate this yes um, uh, yeah why because uh, we very well know log 100 is 2 isn't it yes so two decimals this is the sum now this is these are the clues you can do all this will be coming by practice only you can apply to any type of numerical or any type of sum so thank you for watching students so keep practicing take different numbers cross check but believe me you can apply this anywhere but what are the applications where can i apply this we are going to learn it in the next video i'll be telling you where which which numerical you can apply thank you for watching stay connected